Altogether, I've written about 40 books. That covers UFOs, Bigfoot, the Chupacabra, Loch Ness Monster, conspiracy theories, kind of anything a little bit weird, you know, I'll give it a try. <laughs> When I first got interested in the UFO subject, it was very black and white for me. Aliens were coming from star systems far away from ours. They were abducting people, they were taking DNA and so on. But certainly by the time I was in my late 20s, my thoughts and concepts and ideas had changed greatly. Um, by that point, I began to realize that some of these cases were just too strange to even be extraterrestrial. I would say I take far more like a, an interdimensional approach to the subject today. And many of my thoughts and ideas on the subject were driven by the late John Keel, most famous known for the uh, Mothman Prophecies book. And Keel came to this conclusion as well, the idea that whatever the UFO phenomenon is, it coexists with us. The UFOs do not seem to exist as tangible manufactured objects. They do not conform to the natural laws of our environment. The thousands of contacts with the entities indicate they are liars and put on artists. The UFO manifestations seem to be, by and large, merely minor variations of the age-old demonological phenomenon. 